And the Kaduna State Police Command is committed to improving community policing to strengthen trust and understanding, enabling the Nigerian police force to be more effective in service delivery. State Commissioner ACP Abdul Kader Yahaya emphasized the importance of community participation and urged religious and traditional leaders to support the improvement of police performance. This community policy is a partnership with the members of the public and the police cannot police the community in isolation. Why police is adopting community policing is because it's easier to solve policing issues in the community. A crisis or a problem that's supposed to take one month for police to solve, if you partner with the members of the community, you will solve it within less than one week, which is more cheaper. And the more the police work with the community, the more you create trust. And the more you create cross trust, the more you attract people to come close to you. And the more they come close to you, the more you give them service, good service delivery. The police need to change its attitude. The community need to change their own attitude. Because there are situations where you will be, you will see that the community are the one lowering police for corruption. They are the one lowering police for problem. You will insist on doing the right thing. But they are the one that will go and call other people for pressure on your head to bend the law. So it is all of us that are supposed to change our attitude and do the right thing. Dr. Mohammad Shafa, co-executive director of IMC, aims to create a new mindset and understanding between police and citizens in Nigeria. He calls for a police force that is people-focused, not authoritarian. The Tudumwada community leader urges Nigerians to ensure peace among citizens and restore confidence between the public and police. We realize that police service delivery cannot be effective without us as community as citizens participating playing our role. As much as we blame the police, we failed to play our own effective role in complementing the effort of the police. Not only failing to, failing to complement the police, our legislative arms has also failed to give the police effective need that means. So therefore, we feel that what will the citizen do to make it better? How do you create citizen-focused policing in Nigeria? The world of stereotypes. The wall of prejudices between us and the police have to, have to diminish. We have to break those walls. Or else, we will not have repeat of answer. Of course, we may have the repeat of what? Of the answer event, if not something is not done immediately. And that's why we take this initiative to say by 2024, before 2027, next election, we'll be able to have police that is people focused, not, uh, not police force, authoritarian, power focused, driven, but people driven police in our country, Nigeria. The Police Act 2020. Wonderful th things happened the same year. But one thing that has also happened that many are just partaking today is the buffing of trust building police and care as a result of previous incidents. We will discuss more about and in saying that we appreciate you and we will see how best we can explore clause two of that act which talks about specific objectives which underlines the community policy. Our officer police police uh, men at the stations they are the ones that cause a lot of havoc to the community. Once there's no confidence between those parties I think we find it very difficult to understand. I understood that there is a way they can checkmate what is going on but unfortunately it's in the systems has no good checks and balances. That's why a junior officer or the stations will do something, it's not being punished. That means there's a lot of work the police need to do for them to have this confidence building in our own people in the community. Otherwise, we we'll continue to go that way. People are afraid of going to police station. That's intimidation. Confidence building is what we need, and everybody should be a partisan, a participant in ensuring that this peace exists among us and the confidence between the public and the police. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.